Hi everyone, welcome back to K London. I just kicked my foot up like, like that, I don't know why, I don't have a clue why. Anyway, we're in Matalan real quick to get some baby clothes. One of my colleagues is pregnant, one of Nikima's colleagues is pregnant, and so we're buying baby clothes. Everybody is pregnant. We know what everyone was doing during lockdown, don't we? <laughs> Anyway, um, baby clothes are just so cute. What is she having a girl? Yeah. Oh, they're both having girls. My colleague's having a girl as well. Oh, look at this. Nikima, look at this. <laughs> this is adorable. <laughs> oh my gosh. That, no, this is so cute. Oh my gosh. Okay, so let me look. What do, what 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 do I What do I give her? Oh. These little stuff like look at how cute they are. Oh. Oh. Stop it. Stop it. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Why are they so cute? So cute. Oh, oh, oh. This is ridiculous. I can't cope. If I buy bibs, I would have to have them with the plastic back because I'm sorry. It's useless if they don't have a plastic back. It just means the baby's gonna dribble and wet up its clothes. But what's the point then? It just doesn't it just it's ridiculous. Oh my gosh, this stuff is just so cute. God. Hey. Plastic back? No. It just doesn't make any sense. And this is really cute, but what's the point if it doesn't have a plastic back? Okay, this is quite thick, but it's just, it's ridiculous, it's pointless. None of them have plastic bags. But look, then this is all plastic. I don't know what I don't know what the point is. Right, so what do I buy you lot? What do I buy? Sometimes this should get someone else. What do I what do I buy then? Because I'm not gonna get bibs that just means she's gonna dribble on herself and vomit on herself practically. Um I could get, do you think I should just get one of those little sh cute shoes? They are really cute though. Oh my gosh. Okay, maybe I'm going to go and choose some of those shoes. Yeah, well I was looking at those bibs down there, but they don't have plastic backs. And I'm wondering if it's because it's plastic, but, the, but to me, it's just going to go wet through, right? 
Is this going to work through? The, the, the bib. If it hasn't got a plastic back. Yeah. Exactly. So what's the point? Okay, so these are the choices that I need help with, right? I absolutely love red and these are so elegant and so cute. But these are just adorable because I love this little furry furry. But what do I choose? Pink or red? Help me, you guys. Co leave a comment. Leave a comment and help me. Which ones do I choose? Which one would you choose? Oh, these ones are cute. Which one did you touch? The red ones. The red ones? Oh! The red one! Don't you think it's crazy the way it sounds? Born in 2021. Born in 2021. That's gonna be their date of. Well, obviously, duh, but it just sounds strange. Like, wow. We made it. 2021. Dark it is. All right, everyone. So today's Saturday, yeah, and um, for the past week, tomorrow will be officially a week. I've been arranging a photo shoot with a guy who was going to help me to um, obviously do the photo shoot so that I could have my new Spark sunglasses collection come out on the sixth of November and okay so we live in England right and obviously you don't know what the weather's going to be because it's not like the Caribbean where you have the sun and if it rains within minutes like the the rain's gone and it clears up and you would never believe it rain just like Florida right so I've been like watching the, the um, weather forecast like a hawk because I wanted to do it on a Saturday because obviously I work Monday to Friday but then it was supposed to rain on Saturday so I was like okay maybe I could do it on on Thursday when um, when I finish work but then it was supposed to rain on Thursday as well so it didn't happen on Thursday so then what I ended up doing is saying we're gonna do it on Saturday whether it rains or not but the weather forecast that it was gonna start raining at um, I think it was seven o'clock and then finish at about 11 so I was like okay we're gonna do the photo shoot at 12 got up this morning and it was chucking it down but like what was it to get here across there yeah um, so then it so I said we're gonna do it at 12 right so I like I said I got up and it was chucking it down my mum my sister and the guy I did the photo shoot with were sending me messages saying it's raining <laughs> the weather's terrible is the shoot not going ahead today and I was like no we're doing it we're doing it so I was getting ready slowly I did my makeup I did my hair I had all the clothes sorted from yesterday all the glasses were sorted from yesterday I um all I had to do is finish my hair and um and put my clothes on right I didn't even eat breakfast because I'm like I'm not sitting down getting comfortable nothing when the rain stops I am leaving the house when I tell you the rain stopped at 10 52 a.m. when I got up and I looked at the window I got on my bed I knelt down on my bed right I covered my head with my cover and I was praying and praying and praying I've had business meetings, Zoom calls, and all sorts to make this collection come to fruition. 
and I was like there's no way I'm getting to the last hurdle like and God is gonna shower me with rain on the day that the photo shoot is planned so I got on my knees and I was talking to God and saying don't you dare don't you dare cause me to not do this photo shoot because of the weather you have allowed me to get this far with my planning the photo shoot is the last hurdle Lord I'm praying that you stop the rain and like I said at 10.52 the rain stopped so the photo shoot went ahead my uber driver was asking me what I'm doing and I was telling him about my sunglasses collection I love when that happens because I get to promote it effortlessly and then um we wore three different outfits we did three we wore three different sun no yeah three different sunglasses each and um it took an hour on the dot literally on the dot and um i'm over the moon i'm literally over the moon i can't see the moon right now because it's a bit cloudy but otherwise i would show you the moon and i'd put myself on it oh oh i'm gonna do something you wait and see by the end of the film film the end of the video <laughs> I think I need to be in a movie for real um, by the end of this video you're gonna see something creative because I'm a, I'm literally over the moon with how well the photo shoot went and I can't wait for November 6th for you guys are the first to know this November 6th for the new spark sunglasses collection to come out I'm so excited honestly I've been working really hard for the past month okay for the past month right and i'm finally here this time next week the new collection will be here so i'm so excited i love the fact that all my planning all my hard work and whatever everything that i put into it my blood sweat and tears my getting up at 1 a.m to do zoom calls with people in texas and california is bringing me to this point the sunglasses came they were held up in stands that you guys don't even know you don't know how hard I work and how like things tried to come against me but God that's what I should call this video but God <laughs> no for real though the sunglasses were held up in Stanford Airport but they came yesterday just in time for the photo shoot because a pair that he needed to wear in fact two pairs that needed to be worn for the photo shoot were in um, in my new stock order faith positivity you know what i was so adamant that the rain was going to stop i said no i'm staying positive we're doing the photo shoot and we did it i didn't have footage because like i said it was only an hour so we focused on getting the photos done before the rain came but it didn't even rain the sun came out so i'm just so grateful but anyway off to do food shopping so i will show you how i get down in the aisles of tesco as usual you know when I film in public people still stare at me like we're not in 2021 and like people don't know that there are youtubers that are millionaires there are youtubers that walk around with their camera a big massive camera bigger than mine in their hand all the time and make videos and make money and literally make a living this is not unusual like I said we're in 2021 get with it I'm not weird I'm not a strange person talking to a camera goodness sake don't you agree don't you think it's ridiculous do you see how they all looked at me when they went past mm -hmm. look at this section oh look that's not mushrooms these are my favorite oh i can have these for dinner tonight because i'm hungry but i'm not hungry this will be perfect I don't even care about the price right now. I'm just like, can we just do it? Do you want this one? Oh, stir fry. Um, I've got one in the fridge that I'm gonna have for dinner tomorrow. So maybe this one. It's a bit big though, isn't it? The packet. Oh, hummus. Thank you, Jesus. I'm a fruit fanatic. I just gotta have it. Hey, I got a cantaloupe. I got a mango. I've got a raspberry in the soup and the thing. I've got a pineapple on the kitchen table that has just now ripened. So I'm gonna do something with that. I've got more plum in the fridge and in the trolley so I can do a smoothie. I've got blackberries. I've got blueberries. I've got strawberries. 
I'm a fruit fanatic. Hey, I just gotta have it. Hey, you know what I mean. When I step up on the scene. party because everyone is out because it's Halloween partying getting drunk and doing fireworks and dressing up and everything but we don't get down like that so I thought I'd have my own little reggae vibes and this that vibes and good vibes and positive vibes like I always do when I go back from shopping so my party's gonna continue I'll be dancing like myself and then I'll eat my sweet potato chips I've got work to do my sunglasses delivery order box thing is down there so I've got to go through it and I've got to price all of the sunglasses I've got to write all of the descriptions and um, get everything ready so on I'm thinking if I do it first thing Saturday morning when I wake up my website won't be out of like what do you call it um, in the maintenance um, feature for too long because if I pre-do all of the like description and stuff, all I have to do is copy and paste it into the product pages and then um, add the photos and stuff. I'm so happy about the photo shoot. Wait until you see it. Like You guys are the first to know the date that the collection is coming out. So I hope you feel special and I hope when November 6th comes, you go and have a look at www.sparksunglasses.com .co.uk to have a look at the collection. I will not tell you the theme. You know I've always got a theme, um, but I will not tell you the theme. You have to go and have a look. I am so excited and just like, it's all just worked out perfectly. I'm just so grateful to God. That's why I'm in a lovely state of mind. That's why I feel blessed. That's why I'm falling in love. That's why everything. Oh my God, I love Budget Band and he's just so like, he's on point. Anyway, um, that's it, so thank you so much for watching my Saturday. It was short and sweet again, but I, I like to make sure I give you guys something. So thank you, thank you, thank you for your love and support. I can't believe we have only two more months left of the year. It's crazy. It's crazy. But anyway, make sure you leave a comment because I need to hear from you guys. What, what colour shoes do you think I got for the baby? Well, she's not born yet, so she's a fetus, but, <laughs> no, she's a baby. Um, so, um, what colour shoe do you think I got? Do you think I got the pink ones or the red ones? And, um, what else did I ask you guys? My memory. I'm in a lovely state of mind, like Bridget Banton says. Um, so yeah, I don't know, I can't remember. Make sure you like, subscribe, share, comment. And have a good day wherever you are from Kay London, the boss lady. If you watched the last video, you'd know you have to call me boss lady from now on. <laughs>